Hi, I'm Marivet Rimandaban Algodon. I am the sales manager for export and uh, domestic. I'm based here in Manila. Could you tell us a little bit about the company? Yeah, uh, Mapicon Green Charcoal Philippines Inc. Uh, is a 100% owned by a Filipino inventor, an international award-winning inventor, inventor G Gonzalo Jun Catan Jr. Yeah, uh, Mapicon Green has um, products of activated carbon and green charcoal and um, organic fertilizer. Tell us about a little bit of the history of the product of Mapicon. Yeah, green charcoal uh, is, a, is derived from um, cellulosic biodegradable uh, materials, mm -hmm. which is an um, international award uh, winner for uh, in Geneva, Switzerland mm -hmm. by um, inventor Gonzalo Jun Catan. Yeah, activated carbon products, sir, uh, is, uh, is a coconut shell based activated uh, carbon. So it undergoes its steam process at about 900 to 1000 degrees C. So the primary application of activated carbon is uh, for mining, for water, water uh, filtration, um, air purification, and now um, our um, uh, medical, uh, for food, uh, pharmaceuticals, they also use activated carbon this time. So the target market here is from mining, medical, all yes. the way to the water. Of course, of course, because um, you know what? I don't know if uh, someone you now uh, drink if it's not a purified a uh, water. So we really have to look for a purified water, filtered water. So without activated carbon, we cannot uh, purify it because it's activated carbon that absorb all the impurities of the water. And let's talk about the business plan of Mapicon. Any new products, any new brand, any any new exciting things that we can look forward for Mapicon? Yes, uh, the green charcoal hydrogen uh, fuel. Okay. Yes, that's uh, the, the green hydrogen uh, fuel is another um, innovation came from the original green charcoal. Of course, as uh, what I've said previously, the base of that, the raw materials, is from cellulosic biodegradable waste. So that's really environment friendly. All right, then let's talk about PACMA, the Philippine Activated Carbon Manufacturers Association. Could you tell us a little bit about the organization? Yeah, okay. Philippine Activated Carbon Manufacturers Association based in Davao. So um, currently we were 12 activated carbon processors, but um, nine of them, nine of us, is a member of PACMA. So um, one here in Luzon, where I set as the sales manager, and we also have one in Region 8, um, five in uh, Davao regions, and two in uh, Region uh, uh, Region 10. Yeah. Um, we have we produce the same products and our um, vision aside from uh, cater our um, demand for uh, the Philippines both for filtration for uh, mining industry is our export actually 90% um, of our produce goes to um, export and why why we motivate to produce activated carbon it's because the raw materials that we use in activated carbon is the coconut shell charcoal so previously um, coconut shell charcoal is just a fuel for grilling yeah it is just a waste just a byproduct right after our coconut farmers get the copras but now we, we, we process that to make it a high um, high-end product which is activated carbon so aside we have to understand that uh, cocoa shell charcoal converted process to activated carbon has a higher application what i'm saying the water filtered in my in our mining companies uh, we don't have gold the, the jewelries that we wore we don't have that without activated carbon why because it's activated carbon that absorb the gold so without activated carbon there there would be no gold there would be no jewelries and of course one of the engaged um, in a uh, country's economy is the gold deposits